Hey, my name is Tobias Siegel, and today I want to go over how to use the O3 Arc ozone generators. If you'd like more information about the special features of the O3 Arc, check out our other video linked in the description. First, make sure you have your oxygen source hooked up to the ozone generator. For this demonstration, we will be using an oxygen tank and an ozone water bubbler that will be hooked up to the ozone out port of the ozone generator. On the standard model, this is on the top of the unit. On the plus model, the primary ozone out port is located on the right side. To power on the ozone generator, press the power button. This will illuminate the screen and default to power adjustment mode P-01. The red light indicates ozone is not being produced. To increase the ozone concentration, press the up button. To lower the ozone concentration, press the down button. To start the ozone production, press the set button for three seconds. The red light will change to blue, which indicates ozone is being created. Once ozone is running, you can freely change the ozone concentration as needed. If you don't use the timer, the ozone will continue to run until you turn it off. If you want the ozone to turn off automatically after a set amount of time, you'll use the built-in timer. Here's how. You will first want to set the ozone concentration needed before switching over to the timer. To change the timer, press the mode button. This will pause the ozone output and put the ozone generator in timer mode, which will be preset to one minute. The ozone concentration previously set will not change. To confirm, simply change modes to verify. To increase the time, press the up button. To decrease the time, press the down button. Once the time is set, hold the set button for three seconds. This will start the ozone production and the light will change from red to blue. If you need to adjust the ozone concentration, you will simply press the mode button to change to power mode. Ozone production will pause anytime you change modes. To start producing ozone again, hold down the set button for three seconds. That covers the basic operation of this ozone generator. Now, let's move on to the auxiliary port of the PLUS model. The auxiliary port changes the flow direction of the ozone. Currently, the ozone is exiting from the side port into the bubbler. By pressing the auxiliary power button, the flow will now exit through the auxiliary out port on top of the ozone generator. As you can see, the water has stopped bubbling and the syringe is beginning to fill. If you prefer a hands-free operation, simply plug in a foot pedal to the 3.5 millimeter jack on the back of the ozone generator. As you can see, the auxiliary power light illuminates when the foot pedal is pressed. This covers the basics on how to use both of the O3 Arc ozone generators. As you can see, this is a major upgrade and provides a host of additional features. Like with all Promolife ozone generators, the O3 Arc generators are made in the United States, hand assembled, and hand calibrated before shipping. When purchasing an ozone generator from Promolife, you not only get an exceptional warranty, you also get the best customer service. We can help answer any questions you may have. If you have any questions about the O3 Arc generators, visit our website at www.promolife.com or call us at 888-742-3404. Visit promolife.com forward slash videos or our YouTube channel and subscribe to be notified when we post new information.